Hello everyone, welcome to this quick tutorial today. Um, so recently I noticed that there wasn't very many pieces of documentation on letting people know how to limit their game for mobile platforms. Uh, especially in terms of portrait mode. It's quite, it is obvious but it's not at the same time so it leaves it quite ambiguous for beginners. So I'm going to go in to make a quick tutorial on how to do that now. So we have this scene, if you see in my game I've just got a picture. It's not in portrait, it's in landscape. Absolute meh. So firstly, what we're going to do is we're going to check our build settings. If we go to here, we're going to set it to Android uh, or iOS. Either the same thing, but I'm targeting Android in this case because I'm working on Windows. Publishing to Android is a lot easier and a lot nicer. So that's cool. We're now in Android. All right. Let's go to our game scene. Change it from free aspect to 16 by 9 portrait, which is 9 by 16. And we get this view, which is very nice. Go back to our scene, so you can see it like that. You see the little line of the canvas wrapping around on the camera, cool. So let's go edit. Let's go to our preferences now, and it should, that's the wrong one. Edit project settings, that's the right one. And it will take you to this player section. This is PC controls, this is iOS controls, and this is Android controls. Go to Android, scroll down till you see auto rotation, change it to exclusively portrait, and now the game will always run in portrait mode, regardless of the Android device. X off of that, scale my image in, or scale the camera out, whichever one, hit our game, and as you can see, done and dusted, we have our image in portrait mode, exclusively for the rest of the gameplay experience. Every scene, remember to change this to 16 by nine portrait, nine by 16, Otherwise, you may have a bit of a mare in the long run. You always need it like that, or else, you know, you could randomly go into a scene that goes to landscape, and that's just going to annoy players. You don't want that, man. You don't want that. So, awesome. Thank you for watching this smaller tutorial, little bite-sized one. Looking forward to seeing you in the next one. If this helped, please leave a like and a comment, and maybe check out my website as well. Maybe check out some of the work I've done. That would be pretty awesome. So, awesome. Thank you, guys. See you next time on my next Unity or Games Development tutorial. Bye-bye.